Oh, my God. We don't make enough fun of you already? What? <laughs> oh, yeah. Emily convinced me to do it. You do know that Wham broke up. Uh, <laughs> I like it, and Emily likes it, and that's what counts. So, uh, how are you guys doing? Hold on, don't try and talk all normal with that thing in your ear. Where's Emily? Uh, she's saying goodbye to her uncle. And didn't she just, like, just get here? Yeah, yeah. Easy, Tiger. I just, I hate this so much. I mean, every time I go pick her up at the airport, it's, it's so great. But at the same time, I'm thinking, well, I'm going to be right back there in a couple of days dropping her off. So what are you going to do? Nothing. There's nothing to do. I mean, she lives there. I live here. I mean, she, she'd have to move here. She should move here. What? I can ask her to live with me. Are you serious? Why not? I mean, I mean, why not? Because you've only known her six weeks, okay? I've got a carton of milk in my refrigerator I've had a longer relationship with. <laughs> but guys, when I'm with her, it's, it's, it's like uh, she brings out this, this, this great side of me. I mean, I, <laughs> I love her, you know? And I love the milk. <laughs> but I'm not going to ask some British girl to move in with me. Joey, you say things now. I, look, Ross, he's right. Emily's great. She's great. But this is way too soon. You're only going to scare her. I don't want to do that. No. You don't want to wreck it. You don't want to go too fast. Yeah, no, you're right. I know, you're right. I'm, I'm not going to do it. All right, thanks, guys. Okay, no problem. Just remember to wake us up before you go-go. 